Stevie Wonder, the famed singer whose songs touched millions of hearts, died last night after having a sudden heart attack. He was one of the most famous musicians of all time. 74. Stevie Wonder had been having health problems for a long time, mostly heart issues. Before the first one in 2016, he had two more. The second one was in 2019. He was in the hospital both times and got long-term care. Stevie Wonder stayed positive and dedicated himself to music even though he was having health problems. He played at a lot of concerts and charity events and also went to social events where he spread words of love, peace, and hope. But in recent years, his health had been getting worse. Stevie had to cancel a few shows and cut back on public appearances so he could focus on getting better and resting. His friends and family were always there for him and cared about him. They couldn't help but worry about his health, though. Stevie Wonder had a sudden heart attack at home in Los Angeles on the evening of August 12, 2024. Even though he was quickly saved and taken to the hospital, doctors were not able to save him. Around 11 p.m., he took his last breath. His family, friends, and millions of fans all over the world are devastated and sad. People in the music business and the public were shocked when word got out that Stevie Wonder had died. People who knew and loved him shared their deep sadness and thanks on social media and in everyday talks. The music world has lost a big star in Stevie Wonder. Fans, artists, and musicians from all over the world have said nice things about him. A lot of well-known artists, like Beyonce, Paul McCartney, Elton John, and many more have talked about how thankful they are and how much Stevie Wonder meant to their jobs and lives. Radio and TV stations all over the world have played Stevie Wonder's old hits, which take listeners back to famous times in his work. A lot of photos, videos, and articles about Stevie Wonder are on social media. They range from shots of him performing to personal accounts of how he changed people's lives. Steve Lynn Hardaway Judkins was born on May 13, 1950 in Saginaw, Michigan. He is a famous American singer, songwriter, and recording artist who will never be forgotten in the music world. Because he was born too early, he had retinopathy of prematurity rop, which caused his retinas to tear, leaving him permanently blind. Even with this big problem, Stevie's musical ability showed up early on, and his drive to get things done became one of the most important things in his life. He grew up in a big family, and his mother, Lula Mae Hardaway, was very important in helping him develop his skills. When Stevie's parents split up, he moved to Detroit, Michigan, with his mother and brothers. There, they had a hard time with money. But for young Stevie, singing was always a way to feel better and get ideas. By the time he was nine, he had already started singing in his church choir and learned himself how to play the piano, harmonica, and drums. He was naturally good at singing and loved it, which caught the attention of Ronnie White, who was in the Motown group The Miracles. White put him in touch with Barry Gordy, who started Motown Records. Stevie Wonder was signed to Motown's Tamla label when he was only 11 years old. This was the start of an amazing career. The live recording Fingertips Pint 2 by Stevie Wonder which showed off his amazing harp skills, became his first big hit in 1963. The song got to number one on the Hot 100 chart. Stevie is the youngest artist to ever reach the top of the charts. She is 13 years old. Because of this, people started calling him Little Stevie Wonder, and he quickly became well-known. Through the 1960s, Stevie put out a number of popular albums and hits that made him one of Motown's biggest stars. During this time, the soul and rhythm and blues R.B. sound that defined Motown had a big impact on his music. Stevie started to try out different musical styles and themes as he got older, though. He added funk, jazz, and pop elements to his work. Stevie Wonder had what is often called his classic period in the 1970s, when he put out a series of albums that were both well-received by critics and sold well. From Music of My Mind in 1972 to Talking Book in 1973 and completing this first finale in 1974 to Songs in the Key of Life in 1976, this era was marked by a series of works. With lyrics that are socially aware, new production techniques, and a lot of different musical styles, these records show how Stevie has grown as an artist. A lot of people sang along to hits like Superstition, Living for the City, Higher Ground, and Isn't She Lovely. During this time, Stevie's work won him many honors, including several Grammy Awards. He used his fame to talk about important social and political problems like poverty, racial inequality, and civil rights. This made him one of the most famous and respected musicians of his time. Stevie Wonder has had a very successful career, but he has also been through a lot of hard times and losses in his personal life. One of the worst things that ever happened was that Stevie was almost killed in a car crash in 1973. Stevie was driving between shows in North Carolina when his car crashed into a logging truck. A log went through the windshield and hit him in the head.
He lost his smell and taste for a short time after the accident and was in a coma for several days. Stevie's life changed after that event. It made him more spiritual and motivated him to keep using his music to bring about good change. Stevie has had other problems in his life besides the physical and mental pain of the accident. He's been married three times and has nine kids from different marriages. It hasn't always been easy for him to balance his busy job with his home life. Stevie has also been honest about how hard it is to keep relationships going while being famous. His mother, Lula Mae Hardaway, died in 2006, which was another sad event in his life. Lula was a great mother who always looked out for her kids and helped them succeed. She helped write a few of his early hits, like I was made to love her and signed, sealed, delivered, I'm your Stevie felt a huge loss when she died because he often said that she was the driving force behind his success. Stevie Wonder has also had health problems in the past few years. In 2019, he said that he was getting a kidney transplant because his kidneys were failing. The news came during a show in London, where Stevie reassured his fans that he was feeling fine and was looking forward to getting better. Stevie has kept performing and inspiring people all over the world with his songs, even though he has been sick. Stevie Wonder has shown amazing strength in the face of hardship throughout his life. He is a symbol of strength and perseverance because he has been able to get through tough situations in his personal and business life. Stevie's music has always been a mirror of his life, and millions of people around the world have connected with his ability to turn pain into art. Stevie Wonder left an indelible mark on the world as a singer and a humanitarian. He is one of the most popular musicians of all time, with over 100 million songs sold around the world. He has had a huge impact on many areas of life, not just music. He has worked hard for many years to promote civil rights, social justice, and charity causes. He was able to get Martin Luther King Jr.'s birthday, made a national holiday in 1980, and in 2009, the United Nations called him a messenger of peace for his work fighting for the rights of disabled people. Stevie's accomplishments to music have been honored with many awards, such as 25 Grammys and Academy Award, and in 2014, the Presidential Medal of Freedom from President Barack Obama. His work has influenced artists of all styles and generations, making him one of the most famous and loved artists in history. Stevie Wonder's life and work show how important it is to be strong, creative, and kind. Stevie has stayed committed to his work and his goal to make the world a better place through music, even though he has been blind and been through personal tragedies. His work as an artist and a humanitarian will continue to inspire people today and in the future, and his songs will always bring happiness, comfort, and hope to people all over the world. Tell us what you think about the death of Stevie Wonder. Say your prayers for us, and let us know what you think in the comments. To get the most up-to-date information on him, please subscribe to the channel and turn on alerts. Thanks for seeing all of the movies.